also as a side note, uh, I didn't know that there was a volcanic steam room. Again, again, that's the volcanic water coming out of the uh, hot. This is all volcanic water, mineral water, blah, blah, blah. Um, that changes frequently, but this is actually, they're taking, a, made a steam room around the volcanic water here. And they made a steam room out of it, out of this big old stone thing. So let me walk in here, hope you can see. I can feel the steam here. Look at this. Is that a trip or what? That's that hot volcanic water they just pump it in and uh, capture the steam through all these cobblestones. And I guess they got ventilation or vent, vent holes up there. Oh, it's just cool. What do you think, Chris? You, you don't get no natural steam like this, huh? Wow. OSHA approved. I guess uh, give me enough rocks and cement and I'll build you a... Uh, anyway. This is the top layer level of multi-pool uh, setup. That water is actually pretty clean. It's just that the, it's mineral staining uh, for the minerals. I took out a sample. The water is actually pretty clear. I guess uh, nobody could drain it and acid wash it. That's because it's it's always uh, changing. You know, say 100 gallons in, 100 gallons out, up through the overflow. It's always being replenished. So we're up here in the pool. There's Teresa lounging around. This is that water spraying is from the volcanic. It was a volcanic springs that had volcanic water. I don't know if they process it, they just spray it down. It's very hot. And it cools off in these pools. Like a lot of pools up here. And it's like a pyramid up here. They just pour concrete wherever they can create a Oh this is this is cool. And this is really cool up here. Because it's it gets hot. So I guess they use a natural draft up here. And it's like cool, really cool. These roofs are actually create good ventilation on it. And it's just cool for some reason, I guess, of the drafts, it, you know. So, they got pools all the way up there. That must be the source. I'll, I'll head up to the source. But they just got these water slides. Again, that's very steaming hot water from the vol volcanic uh, source, whatever that is. That water is very hot. It's probably about 104. Feels like a hot tub. If not even hotter. We're in the jungle of Nayarit. Amatlan de Cañas. So I, I walked from over that pool over here. Again, at the hotel they got the other pools over there. Uh, This is all just hometown engineering. No EPA. I guess this must be the volcanic source up here. Because it's just steaming. Uh, oh, I see it. It's just a well that comes out of the ground. That'll probably cook you right there. It's 200 something degrees, obviously. Yikes. I wouldn't even dare touch that. Uh, that looks like iron. That red. They're trying to cool it down.
I guess if nobody's swimming in it, don't get in. Do I dare? Oh, oh man, that's that's golden. Well, there's a reason why nobody's up here. So we're, we're at the top, there's bathrooms up here. And obviously they've got very good hot water to flush the toilets with. It must be a very sanitary sewer, uh, free hot water source. But anyway, these pools are actually cool up here, uh, which I like. So this has got the fresh minerals from the whatever minerals that are in there. I'm sure there's a lot of iron. Uh, so I'm going to be soaking in here to heal. Uh, that pool's cool. We're at the top. That one's not. But anyway, this is the source somewhere over here. And... Uh, it's nice and cool up here, actually down in the valley the, the town is hot, but when you're up here you get a nice cool breeze. So it's a nice get away from the 115 degree heat we were having, or whatever the temperature was. Look at that. Oh, they just pumped it in there. Okay, so they just pump up from cistern to cistern. And then it overflows, and they take the overflow out. So it cools in these little, uh, I guess, cisterns or wells or whatever. And that's how they do it. Just it'll cool down from one to another until it finally gets a temp. And it uh, washes itself every day, I guess, because it just keeps replenishing. Oh, I guess they do drain these in and scrub them and clean them. Hmm, interesting.